Did you know you could whistle with an acorn? Oops, I just <laughs> dropped it. <laughs> We got some muck boots for Taylor. So we're with our friends Jose and Sarah. We're going for a little walk today. Go in there. So this is Sarah. <laughs> this is her husband, Jose. This is where they live. In the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Out in the marshes. <laughs> so we're on a boardwalk about a mile long. Super peaceful. We got a little bit of wind. Beautiful, beautiful day. This is why we need the muck boots. This is Sassy and she's done a lot of hunting in her life. Sit. <laughs> okay, watch your step. Wow, this is awesome. Come here in the morning, you'll see them trading back and forth. All the ducks, geese, and tundra swans later in the season. Oh. So right now, Chief is really excited and he wants to run out ahead and I'm trying to keep him next to me. This boardwalk's only big enough, one person, so there's not enough room for him to walk around me. He could obviously jump off and go around me. Put him behind me on the boardwalk. Jose and Sarah and Taylor, they're way up ahead of us and he's just like dying to go up there. Now, we just stepped off the boardwalk. Come here. And as we walk, he's just like inching ahead a little bit more every time. Chief, come here. So instead of letting him just go out ahead, whenever he gets in front of me, I stop and then I call him back. Still going. Still going on the boardwalk. Did it flip over or fall out of the tree? Well, the tree did fall down. It looks like maybe this tree here. Cause I, I swear you walked right under it. It might have been this guy here. This is a giant uh, eagle's nest that was way up in a tree. Probably this tree right here that fell down. Now it's in the middle of the marsh. Or it's a muskrat house and <laughs> we're about to make a muskrat really. I bet it was pretty heavy. Oh yeah. See any feathers? Yeah. They'll have to build a new one. There's a lot of bald eagles here, right? Yeah, there's, yeah. There's actually two bald eagles flying up there. Way up there. All right, Taylor. <laughs> Good thing you got some boots. Seriously. Find a shed, Chief. Find them. We sent Chief out looking for sheds because they have white-tailed deer here and they also have Sika deer. I'll try to get some footage of them while we're staying here for you guys. So, Jose, you've lived here for three years? Two years. Two years? Two years. Do you like living in this type of environment? It's a little different. Change of pace, but it's definitely awesome. It has its perks. The fall and winter here are beautiful. The summer is pretty brutal. Oh, we made it back to the road. We did not get lost. It's a good time. Hey. <laughs> so they take the top of an acorn and you can turn it into a whistle. <laughs> Small ones are louder. It's a little acorn top. All right, let's see if I can do this acorn whistle. So like bend them out like that. Yep, back to back. Find the sweet spot. There it is. Yeah. <laughs> That's so awesome. <laughs> Did you know you could whistle with an acorn? Oops, I just <laughs> dropped it. <laughs> so if you're lost in the wilderness, you find an acorn. So you want to make a Y, 
with your thumbs like that, back to back. And then the acorn sits right at the base of the Y. Think about blowing right inside of the acorn. Is that what you think about? Yep, yep. Yeah. Just like that. Okay, I'm lost in the wilderness and I need something from nature to help me survive, to save my life. Oh, look at this, I have an acorn and I turned it into a whistle. Oh, it didn't work. Anyways, you saw me whistle me. <laughs> oh look, someone heard my whistle and they came to save me. Hey, you lost? Okay, we're back on the road now. Everyone's safe, acorn saved my life. Let the dog swim for a little bit, do a little bit of training. Now I know, and you know, how to save your life with the top of an acorn if you have to. If you're new to the channel, push the subscribe button all the way in, click the bell so you get notified when we post new videos. This is Chief, we'll see you in the next one. Hats off to you.